Welcome to the fascinating world of the corgis. Today, we'll discuss the history of this beloved breed, their various colors, notable owners, cost of purchase in the United States, common names, average height and weight, medical problems, grooming needs, and places they are commonly found. The corgis, also known as the French corgis or American corgis, were developed in the early 20th century by crossing French bulldogs with English cocker spaniels. This resulted in a breed that was both athletic and intelligent, making them suitable for various roles, including watchdogs and sporting companions. Corgis come in a multitude of colors, ranging from solid black or gray to blue, red, chocolate, and even fawn. The color pattern of a corgis typically depends on the color of their French bulldog ancestors. Notable owners of the corgis include J.K. Rowling, who is known to own several corgis, as well as Hollywood stars like Charlie Sheen and Jennifer Aniston. The breed has also been favored by royalty, such as Queen Elizabeth II, who was known to enjoy walking her corgis, named Nellie and Daisy. The cost of purchasing a corgis in the United States can vary depending on their lineage, breed standard, and rarity. A well-quality, registered corgis may cost anywhere from $1,000 to $2,000, while a more unusual color could be more expensive. Common names for corgis include Teddy, Max, and Bella. Their average height and weight are around 20 to 25 inches and 75 to 85 pounds, respectively. Corgis are prone to a few medical problems, such as hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, allergies, and joint issues. Regular vet checkups and a balanced diet can help keep these problems at bay. Grooming needs for corgis include regular bathing every two to three weeks, brushing their fur daily to prevent matting, and trimming their nails to avoid overgrowth. Corgis are commonly found in the United States in neighborhoods, parks, and even dog shows. They make wonderful companions for individuals and families alike, offering a perfect blend of intelligence and playfulness.